If there's one ingredient that I think everyone can benefit from in their skincare routine, it is a retinoid. And I'm talking about over-the-counter retinol and all the way up to prescription retinoic acid. It all just comes down to which product you are using for your own skin type. So today I'm gonna talk about some of my favorites for this year. If you're new to my channel, my name is Susan Yara. I have been in the beauty industry for two decades. I started off as a beauty editor. I now have my own skincare line and I love to talk about skincare and beauty here on this YouTube channel. If that sounds good to you, make sure you subscribe to the channel and give this video a big thumbs up. If you're unfamiliar with retinoids, they are vitamin A derivatives and they are the most proven to basically do all the things that we want skincare ingredients to do. They help to stimulate collagen production, they help to resurface your skin and stimulate skin cell turnover. They make you have a beautiful glow, they help with hyperpigmentation. The list just goes on and on and on about the benefits of retinoids. They can even help with acne. So really, when people are asking for solutions for their skin, whatever it is that they're dealing with, the first thing I ask is, are you using a retinoid? And if they tell me no, then I'm like, okay, we need to back all of this up and we need to get a retinoid into your skincare routine. If you don't know a lot about retinoids, I have a ton of videos about this topic, so I'll leave links in the description box below, that way you can watch those. I'll also throw out there before I get into the products that I wanna talk about today, most of the retinoids that I go for are for anti-aging purposes and for hyperpigmentation and for that just overall glow. There are definitely retinoids out there that are more targeted towards people who are dealing with acne, and while I would say that all retinoids actually do help with acne. That's not necessarily a reason why I am choosing a retinoid. All right, so the first one I want to talk about is an oldie but a goodie. This is the Verso Super Facial Serum with Retinol 8. This is the first retinol product that really got me to consistently use this. It was probably about five years ago when I first tried this product and I instantly fell in love with it. It was gentle on my skin. It made my skin really glowy and dewy. It felt softer. I noticed pretty quickly into using it, like a month into using it, that I saw improved texture and I saw my complexion just look more even and everything about my skin just, it was the first time I was like, oh my gosh, my skin looks really good. And I knew it was this product, so I ended up buying this product. Even though it's a kind of a pricey product, it's like $120, I ended up buying it over and over and over again. And it's because it kept me consistent on my retinol use and it was really gentle. I never experienced any irritation with this. This to me is a starter retinol product. And the reason for that is because it is built around an ester, a retinol ester that is more of a complex that they have in this formulation. And according to Verso, this is a stabilized vitamin A derivative that is eight times more effective than typical retinol, but also less irritative. I wouldn't go as far to say that this is as strong or as effective, I guess, as a traditional retinol, but I will say, I know from my own personal experience, I saw a huge difference in my skin when I used this. And every time I do pick up a bottle of this, especially if I'm like getting back into the retinol game, which I've had to go through a couple of times because of my past pregnancy, this always ends up giving me a beautiful glow to my skin after a month of using it. And when I get done with one bottle of this, I'm always like, oh, that is so good. So if you're new to retinol, this is a great retinol product to start off on. Next up, I have to talk about this one from my brand, Naturium. This is our Retinol Complex Cream and one of my favorite products of all time, of all all time, and that is because this is one of the best retinols I have ever used. I know I'm biased, but I really mean it when I say that. This is a beautiful formulation. We have encapsulated retinol in here, which is very important in my opinion, because retinol, a lot of people don't realize, is an antioxidant. It also can be a little bit finicky. It's not as bad as vitamin C as far as you know being hard to stabilize, but you do wanna make sure it is stable. And also, encapsulation makes it great because it helps it penetrate your skin better, and it keeps it from being a little too irritating for the skin. So I love that we have encapsulated retinol in this product. But on top of that, we also have two botanical ingredients in here that are retinol alternatives, which I hate that they're called that because there's really no alternative to retinol, but they are bacuchiol and bioretinol. And like I said, they are just plant-based ingredients that have similarities in the way that they function to retinol. And I think that's why they get called retinol alternatives a lot of the time. The reason why I think they're great in this formulation is because they're all paired together with the star ingredient and that is your real retinol. So when you put all of them together, you're getting a lot of different benefits for your skin. The biggest one is that you're getting the best glow 
flow of your life. But on top of that, we also put it into this formula that feels very nourishing for your skin. So there's squalene in here. And then there are lipids that are just really nice for your skin that help protect and support your skin barrier. And also just feel super nourishing for your skin and give you again that beautiful glow. So this is my go-to retinol. This is something I use daily. I talk about this all the time too. When I want my skincare routine at night to be super simple because I'm exhausted, I will double cleanse my skin. And then this will be the only product I put on. And I feel like my skin is great the next day. Like this is all that I need. If you want a very simple skincare routine, this is it, this is the one. Now when it comes to retinoids, I think it's also important to point out that the strongest, most studied, and most proven ingredient is the retinoic acid. That is the prescription strength version of a retinoid. That's usually tretinoin. When it comes to an ingredient like retinol, it actually has to go through conversions on your skin to be able to get to that strength. And that's what makes it so much more gentle on your skin. And it makes the process of seeing results a little bit longer because it's just a slower process. I sometimes think that that is the best way to go. I think that slow and steady wins a race a lot of the time when it comes to your skin. So I prefer that in a lot of ways, but there's also an ingredient called retinaldehyde that only takes one conversion to get to retinoic acid. So I wanna tell you about a couple of products in that category. The first one is by a brand called Medicate. This is their Crystal Retinol 3. They actually have different levels of their retinaldehyde. You actually can get Crystal Retinol 1, 3, 6, or 10. 6 and 10 are obviously stronger than this one. This is right in the middle for me. I do have the six as well. And I feel like if I overuse it, it becomes irritating for my skin, similar to the way I react to tretinoin. So I always back down to the three and I find that my skin just really loves this one. I can use it a lot more consistently and see those results still without the irritation. Something I like about this product, which is something I like about all of these products is that it's also very hydrating and moisturizing to the skin. I think that's really important when you're using ingredients like retinoids because they can be irritating to the skin. So when you have a little bit more barrier support, I just feel like you see better results and you can ease into it a lot quicker as well. So this one is packed with hyaluronic acid and glycerin and has really nice ingredients in it. It feels like a light lotion, like an emulsion. Another retinaldehyde product that I think is just beautiful and I have been loving is this one from Saatchi. This is the Ursolic Acid in Retinol Overnight Reform. And this is beautiful. This has 0.05% retinaldehyde in it. So it's a little bit more in the middle between those two Medicaid products, but it also has just a beautiful blend of ingredients in it. There are antioxidants in here. There are peptides in here. There is ursolic acid, which is also very anti-inflammatory for your skin, which goes back to you know supporting your skin barrier and just supporting your skin in general. When you're using an ingredient like retinaldehyde, that can be a little irritating. I feel like you just see better results Results. I'll say that 0.05% for me can be a little bit strong. So this is taking me a little bit longer to use because I don't use it as frequently as I would just a regular retinol serum or cream. I could probably use this like twice a week and I don't see any irritation. And then when I bump it up a little bit higher than that, then I start to get a little bit sensitive. It's not the same sensitivity I get when I use actual tretinoin, but it does definitely start up when I bump it up to more than two times a week. I'll also point out, I think that the presentation of this product is just gorgeous. I mean, the packaging is beautiful. The way the product is presented and everything, even like the information that is given to you with this product, it's all really beautiful. I'm a big fan of the founder of this brand too. I think she's just a really great person who gives a lot of wonderful information about skincare and just knows a lot about skincare too. She's a cosmetic formulator. So she's probably like one of the best people who could be creating a brand. This is a great product. I think all of the Saatchi products are really great. This is the only one that I have truly used on my skin, but all the reviews I've heard of every product from Saatchi have been amazing reviews. I have not heard one bad thing about this brand. So I'll tell you right now. This one, this is a brand to just keep your eye on. And then last is prescription tretinoin. The one I've been using is from Apostrophe, which is one of the prescription services that you can do online. I like this program. I talk about it all the time. I feel like what makes Apostrophe stand out among all of the other online programs like this is that you're working with a board certified dermatologist as the person you're doing your consultations with. I also think they do a really good job of checking in with you on your progress with the medications that they give you. 
you. They prescribe both topical and oral medications, which I think is also really great. And they have these products that are already pre-formulated to have actually like a blend of different beneficial ingredients. Like this one, for instance, is tretinoin at 0.025%, spironolactone and tranexamic acid, which is perfect for someone like me who deals with just like an occasional hormonal breakout and a lot of hyperpigmentation, this one is really great. We recently lowered the percentage of tretinoin I was using just because I have such a hard time acclimating to tretinoin. So we went down in percentage a little bit and I'm hoping to bump back up to the 0.025%. Right now I can use it like once or twice a week, but that's really the max that I can go. So those are my favorite retinoids of 2021. And I say 2021, not because they're new products necessarily, but because these are the products that I really paid attention to or even went back to in 2021 when it came to retinoids. If you have suggestions, definitely tell me in the comments below. It's always helpful for everybody. You can also ask me questions or find me on Instagram. I'm at Susan Yara and I'll talk to you soon.